Hey everybody, um, on this video we're going to open up three cello packs of 1985 tops that I bought off of Baseball Card Exchange. I paid a little bit more than the price tags show on these. This is I really like this kind of thing where the price tags are still on it. You can see this one has a general merchandise and it says 15. I'm guessing that's 15 cents. That's how much baseball cards were back in the old days. I really like this one because it's got one of my favorite players, Steve Garvey, on it. And you can see this one was 20 cents. And then this one over here, Mike Boddicker, was also 20 cents. I'm a little worried about my ability to open up these packs. So let's see if I can do it and not take too long to do it. 1985 tops. We're looking for... Mark McGuire, Roger Clemens. We're looking for the cards to not all have stains like that on the back. I'm hoping that doesn't happen anymore. It actually fell apart pretty easily. All right, let's see what we get here. Mike Boddicker. And I am having lots of problems with my hands tonight. Or these cards, something, it's weird. I, I, have, I don't know, I, I can't move the pack cards very easily. Mike Boddicker. Mike Ramsey, Len Whitehouse, Tom Hume, Butch Davis, Sean and Dunstan. Sean and Dunstan was one of those guys everyone thought was going to be a big thing, and he was okay for a while, and then it all went downhill. Yogi Berra, one of the greats. I mean, this card is completely messed up in the middle, and that's the reason. The gum. I don't know if you can tell, but this card has got... Oh, well, look at that. <laughs> it has lots of problems. <laughs> Poor Yogi. The gum looks kind of corroded, too. Kind of gross. Uh, but there he is, Yogi Berra. I'm going to just throw that card away. Bob Boone. I'm going to throw that one away, too. Sorry. But it's... Really weird looking. Got some major gum action going. Steve Henderson, which, I mean, now the cards are all bent from the gum. I guess cello packs were not a good idea or something for me to buy. Um, there's a card behind Mickey Hatcher here. It's Tom Pachorek, wimpy. There he is. Tom Bernanski. Alfredo Griffin. And Gary Templeton. I would recommend not buying <laughs> these cello cards. At least that pack. Because that pack had some major issues. As far as gum and staining. Let's see if our 15 cent pack does any better. Oh, look on the back. It's got Eddie Murray on the back. So that's a good one. Bill Dolly. Yeah, these are not in great condition. These are not your PSA type cards. Um, Bill Dolly. Rick Sutcliffe. Domingo Ramos. Jim Wynn. Ah, Pete Rose. Pete Rose. There's a piece of the gum or something. Uh, Juan Samuel, Dennis Eckersley, and Dennis Eckersley <laughs> and Carmelo Martinez have felt the power of the gum. As this guy is stuck, I'm going to throw away Dennis Eckersley. I'm going to throw away Carmelo Martinez. Look at that. Cecil Cooper. Ron Darling. Oh, wait, hold on. Hey, Gary Carter, Hall of Famer Gary Carter. I don't even know if this is still in the picture. There. Ron Darling, this card at one point we all thought was going to be a big deal. Not so much, though, Ron Darling. Ron Gardenhire, Ned Yost, and Eddie Murray. Two Hall of Famers and a should-be Hall of Famer, in my opinion. Who's on the back of this pack? Omar Moreno. All right, 
This pack is kind of exploding as I'm pulling it apart. Steve Garvey. Luis Salazar. Checklist. Checklist. Come on, checklist. Yikes. There's a manager card behind the checklist, so we have to look at that. Chuck Car Cartier. Ed Lynch. Ed Vandenberg. Pete Rose fell down. Maybe the Hall of Famers knocked him over. Ed Vandenberg. Leon Roberts. I've you know I've never seen this before where the gum is on the back of the card, but it's corroded all the way through the front. Let's hope, let's take a look and see how bad it looks. Yeah. How about that? So that's gonna go in the trash. And our friend Mike Sosha is gonna go in the trash also. Daryl Brown shall it probably should be in the trash. Alan Trammell. Is Alan Trammell in the Hall of Fame? Did he just get in the Hall of Fame? John Butcher. Jim Sunberg, one of our old favorite Rangers. Brian Dayette. And Omar Moreno. So there's three packs of 85 tops. Cello packs. I would not recommend buying that stuff. Bye-bye. <laughs> Thanks for watching.